welcome, welcome back everyone. We're back uh, in Invincibles. We'll continue the saga, the story, and see where we get up to. Last time we found this camp. Uh, and we found a not so good shape robot. I think his name's Artie. Uh, that isn't doing too well. Uh, and we sent out our call to our upper dude up here somewhere, up in the sky, up in space. And he said, have a look for the relay. Well, there's the relay. And I think they want us to go find a replacement for the broken relay, which I'm guessing controls Artie. But thanks for joining us, everyone. The Wombat is back. And I uh, hope everyone's doing well. Please smash the like and subscribe. Uh, plenty of this one to come. I should move. Oh, Yasna's saying I should oh, move. There's no time. There's no time. We better get into it. Uh, the last episode I said 15 minutes. Uh, it didn't happen. It was about half an hour. So I expect this one to be about half an hour. Enjoy. find this relay. Oh, here we go. Going back out. Okay. Here we go. Uh, no luck. Oh, they're not in here. Close you off. There. We have to go back inside. Can't go in there. Oh, maybe this one. What's that? Oh, fish. There's a fish. Fascinating. Did you find anything, Doctor? Nice specimen. Oh, it's still alive. Ah, the fish Doctor Gorski caught. Do you remember? Yeah, I remember. Something. Oh, here we go. Flashback. Dragonfly, come in. Uh, hello, Regis. Dragonfly here. Dr. Yasna at the radio. And Lovick? Is his leg still bothering him? Yes. He's been resting in his quarters. We're setting up on the shoreline. It's late, but we still have time to examine the ocean floor. Uh, Gorski is preparing the probe for launch. We'll start research soon. Oh, um, one more thing, Yasna. Yes? It's beautiful here. The ocean, wind, sand. My suit is pinching and cramping just at the mere sight. <laughs> <laughs> Should I include this in my reports? I'm serious. I don't know about you, but over the years I've learned to hate the void. We do everything to go further, see more, take mankind one step closer to omnipotence, and then we can't even take a walk on land. As if enjoying Let's everything that's around mission. us was almost a... You're dramatizing, Koval. We have a job to do on this planet. When we get back, we'll enjoy water, sand, and whatever else our hearts desire. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Homesickness is simply eating me up. We have to examine the composition of the ocean, not the... Collect the mineral samples. Yes, that's right. Do you want to do the honors? Gladly. Koval, where are you going? Probe in the water. Over. I'm switching to manual. For a little, um, uh, uh, quick recce, I'm going to take Distance. a look around. 100. Base, are you there? 300. Uh, a recce? I see no good reason. I won't allow it, Regis. Stay put. Copy that, Dragonfly. I'll stay dutifully at my post. 500. That me. Am I seeing this right? Dr. Crowther, would you please have a look here? Of course. Just a second. It's like... A school of fish. This is... lovely. What are they doing? They're moving away from us. From us? Talking about an artificial robotic gizmo, right from the pole. As soon as I swim it closer to them, do you see what happens? Is this normal, Yasna? What do you think? 
It's hard to speak of normality here, but animals are usually not afraid of equipment or, or anything they haven't seen before. Are you saying they've already seen probes? I've no idea, but their behavior suggests some sort of defense mechanism. A catch at least one for examination. Then I'll be able to say more. Come here. One more time. Got it. Got him. Got him. I had to electrocute him. Wouldn't have caught it otherwise. I'm taking the specimen ashore. At least it wasn't the one that got away. That's a fine one. There'll be plenty to dissect, yes, no. <laughs> Oh well, that's good. We worked out what the flashback was, but we still haven't found what we came for. Or are looking for. Exciting, there's fish on the planet. Alright, so we haven't been to this one yet, maybe in this one. I have the extra relay. Excellent. The signal should be back as soon as it's turned on. Alright, so where am I going? A bit close you. Don't want any dust to get in there. Now, where do they want us to go? Oh, here we go. We're going to set it up here. Okay. Alright, set you up there. Awesome. What happened here? Is it going to work? We'll see. I rebooted the systems. That should help. Good, good. It's receiving instructions. Looks so good. Love it. Oh, jammed. He's jammed. Oh, can I kick him? I don't know if the Androbot should already be doing something. Is it still frozen? Yes, unfortunately. <sighs> He's flat. The positronic brain has correct readings. Receptors. Hmm. Oh, I was trying to work out what's going on with the robot. We'll explore, huh? Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. I've got to press that button. It's not a button, his eyeball. Oh, there he goes. <gasps> what? He moved. Finally. Oh. Artie should be walking now. Does he? His positional yep. data hasn't changed. No. Nope. <laughs> well, you can see that he really wants to go, but still can't. <laughs> uh, please check his legs. Hmm. Just kick. 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 Ah, that's it. Gargi, tin bastard. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Doctor. I won't hold you any longer. Go find the others while I finish here. That's an order. Yes, sir. Okay. We're here. Is that us? Landing. Landing. That's us. We've got to head out here. All right, let's go. Find the rest of the crew. Well, that's what we're going to do. Excavation. Uh, so something to the left. Oh. 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 Finally, it works. What works? I can't Corrector. see nothing. Five meters. Careful. That was weird. Maybe a loading screen or something. That, please. marked by Dr. Crowther. There's no one around. What do you think? Can we land the hopper safely here? I think so. Solid ground, a large flat area. We won't find a better place. Entry point? Will it be 50 meters? Uh, 
Air accessibility is paramount. Excuse? Yes, it's Plenty relatively room. clean. You Don't can know send what you're hopper, landing. We're landing something. Here it comes. Oh. Huh. It looks like the rocks at the landing area. The, the ones drawn by Crowter. The doctor marked a waypoint. I don't recall. It's it's just a sketch. No markings. Well, if so, we should do it. What would you call them? Oh. Twins, I guess. There's twins. The titans, the bones. <sighs> These rocks are white as bones. Yeah. Bones, then. Writing that down. Me too. Well, one more thing, Astrogator. The bones are, well, literally almost white. Unlike the environment around them. Yes, thank you. That's valuable information. Be useful in navigating. The bones. Alright, and what are we waiting for? Are we doing something else here? Uh, Alright, we're going to keep going, looks like. Uh, Alright, we're going to go up here. Let's go. Hopefully we can find the crew. Yes, you're getting tired. I'm running. Oh, we've got something down here. Ooh. Oh, damn. I seem to have gone too far. Oh, okay. I can see the field markings that Dr. Gorski left behind and haven't found anyone yet. They all may have left the area as well. But before you move on, make sure to check the whole perimeter. As long as I'm here, let's see if I can spot someone in the distance. Mm, right. Anything interesting? Not that I can see. Nothing of interest. Go back over here. Not too much of a drop. Right, let's go through here. Right. Nothing of interest, sorry to say. Alright, we're going to head back. Didn't tell me I couldn't jump down here. Can I fall down here? No, so it's not going to let me go down. No landmarks. No. Alright. Nothing of interest. Let's go back. I'm still here, if you're wondering, sir. It all just takes longer than expected. I know the situation. No need to explain yourself, Doctor. We're in this together. We'll do it. Oh. I'm entering the research area. Clear for now. Tracker? Silent. By the way, what did they find here? Oh, right. You don't remember. A piece of metal sticking out of the ground. Yep, there it is. Sounds inc Got someone. I'm following the signal. Huh. It, there's something on the ground. Pick you up, tracker. Right there, it's here done. we go. Geological cross section. Let's focus on both water chemistry testing and geological. Really excited. Measurements. Here's a Merritt's notes. Oh, she must the be middle. somewhere close. Please search the entire area thoroughly. Back again. What to say? Yeah, that's not that exciting. Oh, what's this? Yeah, nothing exciting. All right, cool. Close it up. Oh, we've got something else. We've got something else.
Guessing that's really hot. Alright, now I did. Ooh. That's cool. So, there's something. There we go. I think I know where I can find her. Alright, up here, up here, up here. Come on, let me get up. Yes. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, we've got nothing else. What do we the got? Backpack. Coming from a castle of backpack. Oh no. That is concerning. I'm close, but I can't see her. Oh, here we go. Here we go. She's here. I found her. Marit, wake up. Wake up. Do you hear me? Doctor Marit? No. No Bates vital here. functions. What's going on? I need on? to. One. Two. Three. Come on. One. Two. Nothing. Don't do this to me, Merritt. Don't. Please. Come on. Let's go. Lift up. Merritt. Thank you. Come on. Doctor. Yasna. No. That's enough. Enough. <sighs> Merit. Astrogator. She's all she... over, Red Rover. Doctor. Yasna. We have to find the others. Please give me a minute. Of course. Everything will be fine. Damn. All fine. That's no good. Cover's good. next. Yes, I think so. You should be close. Do you think Cover? Let's not assume the worst. You'll find it, Doctor. Alive. I'm sure about that. Someone's here. for a second, Doctor. What's his current state? Checking. Parameters normal, yet he's completely unresponsive. Yeah. Same as the other dude. Kovel. Kovel. His eyes are so empty. Just like Crouter's. Kovel, what the hell is wrong with you? Are all the symptoms the same as Dr. Crouter's? <sighs> he's calm. Karma. Well, at least he's alive. Now listen to me, Yasna. The lander is on its way, but before you get Dr. Cobble on board, I want you to do something. Yasna. I'm listening. Please look around for his journal. It's everywhere. In pieces. Ah, not good. Cobble was in radio contact with Dr. Gorski. Taking notes. That's exactly why it's so important. These notes may help us find our man. I'll go over them, but it may take a while. Let's grab the one. Ah. Ooh. Have you found it? His life on this planet, no, after all. Uh, nothing about Dr. Gorski. Ah. Found them. Surprisingly accurate. He wrote down Gorski's every step. Great. Let's get Koval to the evacuation area. Can you carry him, Doctor? <laughs> Won't be pretty hard in 1G. But the gravity here should make things a tad easier. Got him. 
here we go, rescue pod. The underbombing crowd is also on its way to the site. It'll need short That's cool. The land is already descending. to find a consistent pattern. All of this seems insane. Pure chaos. But I don't believe in coincidences. The greatest threat to humans is usually, well, humans. So I believe our crew members have fallen victim to the Alliance's actions. Something's going on. I must say, in any other situation, I'd be sure of it. The Invincible, however, is not in the Lira system yet. Their own ships have never even ventured near these regions of the galaxy. Or at least, there's no indication. Except for all these disturbing events. Mm. Right. Something, Something needs going on. We're gonna work it out. Ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna keep going. We're gonna see where we end up in the next 10, 15. See you up there. Am I getting out? I am getting out. Only Gorski. See you, Artie. He might have made it quite far. Agreed. Everything points to it. I don't know how long I'll be looking for him. It might take hours before I come back. We also don't know Gorski's condition, nor what he's going through. We're gonna go All find right. him. Dr. Gorski's next, but I'll be back for Marit as soon as possible. I don't want to leave her like this. You won't. I'll send the Androbot. Once Dr. Crowder is safe, she will fly with everybody. Back home. So we're gonna go up here around to the left, I guess. Go back the same way. So we can do a bit of running now. Oh, again, how good does this look? That's amazing. Very nice. Don't know if we should go down here. Because if you look at the map, that's going somewhere else. But we haven't been over to this. Yeah, so we come up here around to the left. What was that? Status? Nothing's changed, Astrocator. Understood. Alright, so there's nothing here. This is where. There's no other way to go through here, it's just a dead end. Alright, so dead end. Dead end, we can't go that way. We can't jump down there though. Do we go back and have a look at the excavation site? Because I don't think there's anything here. Got all those notes. It's nowhere. Can we go in this water? I'm just wondering. Status? What's hmm. new? Well, nothing really. At good. least not in the last five seconds, huh? Right. Thank you. I can't know up there. Only a dead body, but. We didn't try to get up here, did we? I doubt we can go up here. No. Hmm. 
Just gonna leave her there, poor thing. Nothing here either. The only thing we haven't done is gone down near that metal structure. But it's really not in the right direction of Korski. So... We're going to go down here. Yasna? Everything's alright? Yes. Here we go. Yes. I just need a moment to think. There we go. What's going on? Yeah. Doctor? Checking! It's a drill! So damn loud! Uh oh. Uh oh. Flashback time. Did you see it? Uh, yes. Uh, it's the same on the other side. Any progress? Uh, we dig as far as the terrain and out. It will take a while. Regis, come in. Status report. Astrogator, sir. We dug up another three cubic meters. The object exhibits remarkable structural homogeneity. All spectroscopic analysis shows similar results. Steel with tungsten and nickel alloy? That's right, with the addition of other common metals. Is there any chance of retrieving the entire object for research purposes? No, none at all. Even sonar couldn't cover the entirety of it. Instead, Dr. Gorski calibrated the detector, so we had to look beneath the surface. And? What did you see there? Uh, more of the same. What protrudes above the ground is just the tip of the iceberg. We estimate it extends at least 50 meters underground. Uh, I see. Oh, uh, furthermore, it's not a single object. Down below, there is an entire root system. So vast that it's impossible to cover it all at once, either with a scanner or a detector. Have you followed its course? Dr. Gorski's doing just that. Gorski, are you scanning those routes? Affirmative. Uh, I'm headed westwards. Been going for a few hundred meters already. Still haven't reached the end of it. Sorry Looks to interrupt, like gentlemen. We're but going that, that way. Confirm my suspicions. This area has been tectonically inactive for a very long time, and the Aeolian activity is minimal. Therefore, the material that has settled on, or rather covered this metallic structure. It's very old, which means these structures are even older. Well, what are we talking about here? A few thousand years? Tens of thousands? Uh, I can't give a precise assessment, not yet. I'm asking for a rough estimate, Merritt. Uh, well then, I guess it... It could be hundreds of thousands, if not millions of years old. Mm. Anything else? Yes. These structures almost certainly didn't form through natural processes. Almost? Well, they don't look like anything I've seen before. And you know I've seen a lot, Novik. Also, I can't find any scientific explanation for this form. Hmm. Could this be what the Alliance is here for? I oh, don't make a guess that. I really don't know. Uh, personally, I Go doubt the map. it, Astrogator. The more research we do, I'm not convinced I am that it serves no purpose at all. It's even hard to imagine this could ever have any function. Regis, come in. I've registered a slight change in the radiation readings. Hmm. And now? Uh, it's in the green, right? Ah, that's your doing. Uh, X-rays from the detector. Exactly. Our probes are quite sensitive. They record even the slightest change. Is one of our devices also causing an increase in the electromagnetic field? Electromagnetic? No. We would have to activate a force field generator, but we didn't even bring it. Uh, Dr. Carter, uh, wait a second. Gorski, what did you say about the field? Well, Yasna noticed an increase in the EM readings. 
which doesn't make much sense. Okay. Oh, I'll take it again. Oh, it's going Regis, crazy. Reception. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Carl, can you hear us? Over. Go, Harry. Get out of there. Hear you. Damn it. Just uh, go away. What from now, sir? What you're doing. We listen. Wait for the interference to pass. Excuse me, but I don't think it will pass on its own. We need to take action. What do you suggest? I can board the second lander and fly to the surface. Yes, sir, I can't let you go alone. My leg. That's how we ended up there. Alright. So. I'm going to have to drill. Phew. It's finally stopped. Yes, sir. Are you there? I am. Unfortunately alone. Working equipment gave me hope. But someone just abandoned it. Didn't even turn it off. Oh. Oh. We need to expand our search rates. Alright, so we can't do anything in the tunnel. This may have to wait till the next episode. So that tunnel is good. let's see what we've got on the map. Um so we're down here. Can we go the opposite way? It's just the way out. But he's down there. We need to somehow get to him. It's the way we came in. Hmm. Where do we go? Been all around here. Oh, this mission drags on so much. Sometimes I think you're going to take off without me, sir. <laughs> Don't count on it, Doctor. I'm not going anywhere. No, we're not. All right, just want to go backwards and forward. Oh, here we go. Um, well, this is where we've been. Let me go back to the page we're on. Alright. Uh, I really don't know where to go from here. Um, can we get into there and... where we came from. It's our ship up there. Uh, my legs feel really heavy. Give yourself a moment to rest, Doctor. You certainly deserve it. Okay. Then that way is where we can't get through. Might just pop back down here. Just make sure I didn't miss anything. And then you guys will see me back in a second. I can work out. So we came down here. We haven't been this way, have we? But that no, this just takes us out. Yeah. Yeah, we're just going back the same way we came. One step at a time, Yasna. One step yeah, at a well, time. She could let us go through here and we'll be fine. But it doesn't let me go through here. See, I just want to go through here. Why can't it just let me go through here? And here.
Alright, we're gonna go back to the same place we went before. Seems to be slipping through my fingers like sand. So much sand. You're so tired, Jasper. <laughs> because I am tired, Astrogator. Excavation site. Huh. How did he come down? I can't come this way. That's good. <sighs> well, here we go. Here we go. Here I we go. Gorsky signal. Yeah. So soon. It's unlikely to be here. Then who? You were correct, sir. It's just our probe. It looks inactive. Can't be completely broken if you picked up a signal. I'd say it's running in safe mode. Please try to power it on. Do we have time for this? It's for a good reason, Doctor. The probe could prove useful in the search. And besides... Okay. I'm opening the probe. Turning the systems on... No, no, stop. Wait for my instructions. There's a button on the left side of the fuse box. Hold it, and then turn the dial again. Now go ahead. Ooh. Slide records? Correct. I, I didn't know we had access to them. You couldn't have known. This is not standard procedure. But as they say, extremis malice, extrema remedia. Let's take a look. Ooh. Ooh, fish. Fish. Oh, they got a fish. I wish they could eat it. A photo of the first days on the surface. They started exploring the littoral zone almost immediately. They reported as much. Wasn't until the fourth day the comms failed. I, I recognize these structures. This is where they began to dig. Twelve hours passed. Three crew members are still there. Dr. Gorski must have left already. We lost contact shortly thereafter. The probe followed him, and he followed the detector's readings. Going after those metal structures. Yes, that's what I meant. What's next? There. Last slide. There's mostly noise. Nothing in particular stands out to you, Doctor. They were digging and suddenly, poof, people are dead. No need to shout, Astrogator. I'm just letting you know what I see. That's all. Uh, hang on. An absurdly high electromagnetic field reading. That's something. Sort of. What are the earlier readings? Checking. Still high in the slide just before. And earlier. Quite normal. It happened in a matter of seconds. But there's... There's nothing except dunes. Sand, a few rocks, a shadow. Look up there. A shadow. Another sandstorm, I guess. All right, Doctor. Let's move on. You may turn on the fuses now. We'll take the probe with us. Oh, that's awesome. Got it on my radar. Now I can give commands to the probe. And? What do you see? Is it working correctly? Yep. If you run it on manual steering, sir, then, then it works just fine. That's exactly what I'm doing. 
have a keen eye. I'll put it in auto mode. From now on, it will follow you, Doctor. Oh, be nice to have some company. I mean, apart from yours, sir. One second. Oh, that's odd. There's no data in the probe's memory. No ID, no nothing. Do you want to give it a new ID? Name it, basically. After all, it'll be with you for a while. So, what's it going to be? Huh. A name for the teleprobe. All right. I can think of something. Copy that. I'm listening. Oh, I thought I could name it myself. Maybe B or Ball E, uh, Wally. Luna, since it orbits around me. I was going to name it like Wombat Probe or the Probe of the Wombat. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> um, I don't want to mean B. I don't want to, let's name it Luna. Please enter Luna. L U N A. Done. Now, a few more tweaks. And you'll have a flying measurement center at your disposal. Waiting, waiting. I want to get on with the mission. Can I get down here? Cool, here I can. Yeah. I don't see these metal structures anywhere. The only surface structure reported was from the excavation area. The detector's measurement is very clear. I'm going straight on. No crossroads? Branches? Not yet. Just one thick, tangled vein. There is. How's my probe going? I'm still going to call it the probe of the wombat. Oh, what's hey, this? Oh. What's this? Look, 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 we can find something here. Look. There's metal inside here. Look, 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 look. Here we go. Told you there was something up here. Look, it goes all the way up here. No. Well, 30 minutes uh, goes into about a 45 minute to an hour episode. Ladies and gentlemen, so enjoy. Oh. Enjoying it so far? I am. Hopefully you guys are too. Three, two, one. What, what are you the doing? Three, two. Departing. Yes, they're on their way. Thank you for your assistance. Oh, Without there your is. help, it would have taken much longer. What about me? What's the plan for the second flight? The same place? That would work best. Certain, proven. When you and Doctor Gorski come back, I'll send the lander right away. Right, here we go. See if we can get to the top of this hill and then we'll uh, finish the episode. <laughs> the probe doing anything for me? Not yet. Ah. I saw this from down there. He said, can you see anything? Well, I actually saw it. the top. The doctor discovered something new from here. Something he called Underground Gym, massive vertical as if it's water tank. Underground Ooh. Okay. Shiz. Huh. I've heard that term before. In their conversations between Kovel and Gorski. No, Jasna. You're the one who reported it to me. Right after you landed. Seriously? Well I I don't see anything like it now, sir. Wait. Koval noted down the parameters. Azimus 350. A distance 200 meters. Copy that. I'm sending the probe. 
Oh. Oh. What's the, what the hell's happened with the probe? Oh, here we go. Can I zoom? Oh, yes. Ooh. There we go. I see some uh, lava. Where we came from. Oh, I just saw a. Yep, there it is. Oh. Got it. I see the bushes. And the doctor? Um, hard to tell. Visibility is poor. Uh, it's going to be harder than before. I don't know how the doctor. Uh, when it comes to finding a safe route, there won't be a problem. But you'll have to get there on your own two feet. Oh. I suppose a probe will carry out the first task. It's capable, yes? Of course. I set the environment analysis mode. The probe will calculate the best route between your location and your destination. It'll guide you along the defined path. The calculations will only take a moment. Cool. Let's uh, unequip for a minute. Oh, I think this is perfect place to leave it in this a beautiful, beautiful visual scene right here. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, my, uh, the good sir up there tells us what's next and how we get to our location. You have to wait till we, the next episode to get there. But uh, thank you all for joining me. Uh, I know I'm not doing too much talking on this series because it's got a story. So there's not too much to do other than have a bit of a giggle throw in my two cents um, and go from there so I am really looking forward to this I haven't read the book so that's what I like I haven't watched anybody else's playthroughs or anything because I want it all to be a surprise so you guys might be saying oh it's over there it's over there but I won't know because uh, otherwise the game is not enjoyable I was traversing this planet I'm becoming more and more convinced that what I know is not the same as what exists Maybe not. Oh, can exist. I must admit, it's an interesting thought. But quite disturbing. It's a large place, the universe. Alright, are we waiting for that? But anyway. Thanks, guys. And please a subscribe. Give a bit of a tick and a thumbs up. Oh, it looks like we're going over the Hi, thumbs Luna. up. Lead the way. I must say, 